This is the model of the dorsum of the fork. This is the superior extensor retinaculum. And this Y shape is inferior extensor retinaculum. Superior extensor retinaculum, inferior extensor retinaculum. These are the two bands of the inferior extensor retinaculum forming a Y. Now this is the continuation of anterior tibial artery and deep peroneal nerve. When anterior tibial artery passes behind the inferior extensor retinaculum and reaches the dorsum of the foot, it continues as dorsalis pedis artery. This is the dorsalis pedis artery. This is the first dorsal metatarsal artery, which is giving the first dorsal digital arteries. The deep peroneal nerve divides into medial and lateral branches. The medial branch gives cutaneous supply in the first web space, and the lateral branch gives the innervation extensor digitorum brevis and extensor hallucis brevis. These are the long tendons of the this is the long tendon of the extensor hallucis longus and these are the long extensor tendon of the extensor digitorum longus. This muscle here, this is the extensor digitorum brevis. These are the tendon of extensor digitorum brevis inserting into the extensor expansion formed by the long extensor tendon of the extensor digitorum longus and on the distal phalanx, phalanges. This muscle here, this is the extensor hallucis brevis muscle. This is the tendon of the extensor hallucis brevis muscle. These are the digital nerves, dorsal digital nerves and dorsal digital arteries. This is the arcuate artery, a branch of the dorsalis pedis artery. Tendon of the extensor hallucis longus, extensor hallucis brevis muscle, tendon of the extensor hallucis brevis. These are the long tendons of the extensor digitorum longus muscle. This is the extensor digitorum brevis muscles. This is the dorsalis pedis artery. This is the deep peroneal nerve.